Hello. That's too hot. Right, okay, hang on. Let me t let me move that up. Hello. Hi. Can you hear me? All right. Is the volume good? Sorry, I'm out of breath because I just had to turn the box around and it's really heavy. Are we good? Hello. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? You can hear good. Nice. Love a secret lab. It's yeah. Well, I fucking hope it's good anyway because um. God, it cost a fucking ton. A resub. I can How my kind hands. of Hello. you. I am forever in oh. your debt. What a waste of a year and a bit. Thank you, mate. I really do appreciate that. I'm looking up there because I think my webcam's still up there. Thank you very much, mate. For the 14 months. I've got cookie clicker on in the background, everyone, just to let you know. Um, there you go. Look, I've got some... Uh, oh, for fuck's sake. Ignore that. Um, thank you very much, Joel Nerd. I really appreciate that. 14 months. Long, long time. Thank you. I have mine nearly a year now, and I love it. We'll buy them forever. Well... Every review I've heard from people that I know that I've got one have been like, oh, it's dead good. It's really worth it. I went on Reddit the other day and it's a load of people going, oh, this shit. Um, <laughs> sorry, I'm, I'm going to stop playing Cookie Clicker now. Um, hello, Jinxie. POV, waiting for you kebab at 4am. Hello, Jinxie. Welcome in. How's it going? Um, yeah, hello, everyone. So I'm building this on stream today. Because, um, for those who don't know, last time I built my chair, I didn't build it on stream. My old chair. And I put the seat on it. Um, the wrong way round. And I didn't realise for about two weeks. Um, and that's probably the reason why it was, like, completely broken by the end of it, sort of... Well, I'll say by the end. By about two weeks in. Um, so that was nice. Uh, so that's... that. So I'm, I'm building it on stream today. Because then, like, you know, if I do mess it up, then you can all go, Oh, you've messed it up. But don't don't pretend. Don't go like, oh, you've messed it up and I haven't. Because I'll ban you. Um, is that alright? There it is. It's a ma... Do you know what? I don't know how the guy got it from the van. To be honest. Um... It's fucking heavy. I was having trouble dragging it along the floor. But that's because I'm weak. Uh, hello V, welcome in. How are you doing? So you got the Titan, I've only got the Omega, so yours is even better. So yeah, I got the uh, Titan 2022 Evo, or whatever it's called. The, the like the new one. Um, does it say on it? Titan Evo 2022 XL as well, because I'm an XL boy. Um, hello, Manikai. Welcome in. Got mine upstairs all by myself. I don't know how you did it. I mean, maybe yours doesn't weigh as... 37.5 kilograms, this box is. Um, apparently, according to the uh, the uh, the notification that I got from the company that delivered it, who were called XP... What are they called again? Never heard of them in my life. XDP. Never heard of him. Never heard of him in my life. XDP. Um, so I was immediately worried by that. Um, and then they sent me a little map to like track where my parcel is. And that also worried me because... Um, I, I could show you that map. And I could not dox myself because it was so zoomed out. So it was basically useless. Um, for, the box is 37.5 kilograms, yeah. Um, what's that in American? Like what? 80 pounds, something like that. 80, 85 pounds, something like that. Um, yeah, the, the the big. There you go. I'll, I'll come down here. Look. The the um, the heavy. It's like a sofa. It is. It's honest to god. Honest to god, it's very heavy. Um, and it's massive. It's a it's a bigger box than. Let me see if I can show you. Actually, hang on. So that's how tall the box is. But that's how wide it is. Like it's like a cube. It's like a cube. It's a very big box. If I stretch my arm out, I only get halfway across it. It's a massive box. Screw about that address. I already have done. Don't worry about it, mate. Look. Okay, well, that's broken everything. But you can see. I've, I've scrubbed it out. I'm not an idiot, mate. But thank you. Right. Um, 
Just the dad's recline from Phasia. Oh, I wish that was a skin for it. That'd be fantastic. Spent many 18 plus hour days in my secret lab chair and never once had a numb bum. Well, this is the thing. I sit in my chair for like 10 hours a day, every day, for like ages. So, um, I I'm hoping it'll be worth it. I'm sure it will be. I got a five year warranty with it anyway, or three years, but it's five years now that I mean, now that I'm doing this, actually, technically it's five years because all you have to do is basically just prove that you've got one and post it online. And I'm, if I'm streaming it, then that counts, I think. Um, best review of them. <laughs> Starting to sound like a Secret Lab salesperson, but I still don't regret it. I fucking hope not. Should we get going? Um, all, I've, all, I've, all I'm armed with is a pair of scissors, to be honest with you, at the moment, um, which I'm sat on. I have got one of those little, uh, is it a monkey wrench or whatever they're called? Um, I've got one of them, um, if I do need one, which uh, they might come with one anyway, so I, I think we'll be fine. Unless they start fucking about with screwdrivers because I'm hopeless with them, but we'll have to see. Best 400 quid I ever spent, yeah this was, it was only going to be 300 and something, 380 or something like that, but because I'm in exile, um, 450 it was roughly and I paid an extra 20 to get a uh, fabric and not leather because I like fabric rather than leather um so you just can't see this obviously but there's a bot can I get my webcam around here don't want it to disconnect that's all so I've got to open it from here it says you'll your unboxing experience starts here. So I've got to open it here. Um, what I might have to do is actually turn it around and then pop it up against my door and sort of trap myself in to my room until it's done. Um, because I don't really see any other way of, of getting out because it, I'm, I'm very much cramped in here. So I'll have to see about that. You have the DVA one. I don't know what DVA is. You got the fabric too. Is it good? I just got the black fabric one because I thought any other one and I'll just end up making it dirty. Oh, the Overwatch character. Ah, wouldn't have a clue. I'm just delaying this, by the way. Let me check my phone. I've got an email. Oh, I'm just me. It's just them telling me it's delivered. Lovely stuff. Oh. Right, let's get cracking then. Um, right, I don't know how to do this actually. Do you reckon? I am stalling. I honestly am. Do you reckon it's worth me turning it round? And it probably is, isn't it? Right now. Oh. Right. Can you see that? Would you like me to move my webcam? Because I can probably move my webcam and pop it. Like that. Is that better or, I mean, if you do, if you do that, you're just gonna see my ass, which isn't necessarily a bad thing, but I don't think that's what I wanna have on Twitch. Hello Edie, welcome in. <laughs> think of it this way. Everywhere's crappy and there's abuse everywhere. We should haven't seen it in the news, so enjoy the DVA chair. Yeah, I mean, yeah. You've got it now, so it doesn't really matter, does it? That's why I'd say, hello Edie, welcome in, I hope you're doing well. It's a very nice shirt, thank you Moon. Thank you very much. Um, you've built like three of these now, so if you get stuck, let me know. I will get stuck, I'm terrible at following instructions. Um, is that each half of that box for each butt cheek on that? Oh, Jenksy, it's an XL, so it probably is. <laughs> this counts better. Well, we'll see, right, let me think now. I mean, I could pop it. Hmm. Um. I could pop it on the floor. <laughs> I could pop it there. Is that any good? Do you want me to change the is the gain all right? Do you want me to change the gain a little bit, make it a bit brighter or something? Or I'm gonna knock that over, but I don't mind. 
Do you want it like that? Is that a bit better? I think that might be the way to go. Not specifically because you're arse, but because there's nothing fucking to you. <laughs> yeah, I know, that's fair. Your house in my house. Right, first of all, I'd just like to say, don't fuck about with scissors, because um, it's bad for you. What game are you playing after the chair fun? I don't know. Um, I'm not sure. I don't know if I even will. I might. It depends how long this takes. If it takes an hour, I'll play somewhere else, but if this ends up taking two or three hours, I might just call it there. Um, we'll have to see. I'm not sure. Um, I was probably going to play Story of Seasons, but I don't know. I'll have a think about it. We've got time. Yeah, don't don't mess about with scissors, everyone, because the physical and mental exhaustion will mean the stream ends immediately. After t yeah, honestly, I'm expecting that because I'm terrible at this stuff. Absolutely terrible at it. Awful. Just awful. Right, I'll fuck that up immediately. Hang on. It's a nice box. I want to hold on to the box, do you know what I mean? <laughs> Honestly, I'm, I'm worried that I am going to do some like terrible mistake. If that was really loud, I'm sorry. Do the sturdy box like that for moving. It is a good box, and that's why I want to hold on to it. You could put some serious gear in that box. Um, so yeah. Right, I think I've got to have this. Do you reckon it's worth me flipping the box so this is at the top? I feel like that makes <laughs> sense. Right, okay. Defo says Ducky, right, okay. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. I don't know if I've got the, uh, just about, if I move my bed back like that. It's heavy. Fucking heavy. Right, now that camera angle is useless. So I'll move us over here, look. That's even more useless. Right, I'll just put us back here, look. Do you wanna go there? Do you wanna go there? That's better, isn't it? If a fire starts in here now, I'm dead, because I can't get out. I struggled for space when I built mine, built it in my 2x2 two two office <laughs> that had my desk and everything in it. was a struggle, I can imagine. I, I'm, I'm going to struggle in here because I've not got a lot of space at all. I've basically got this and that's it. Um, how tall are you? I'm 6'2". I'm 6'2". Do oh, a lovely bit of... Oh. Check that out. Wait, you can't see this. Check this. You can't see that because of the... Hang on, if I get in the way there, look. Look at that. It's got the instructions on a big bit of card. Instead of some terrible bit of paper that hasn't got any words on it. Hang on, let me just read this for a second. Having a friend to help can make the assembly process even easier. Nice one. Well, good thing I've got loads of mates to help me then. I feel like you're just paying for the folders and stuff at this point. Just got a little. You just can't see this because the the curtains like right there behind you. It's a secret lab access, although you can't actually see that. What's this? The access kit. Oh, it's just a user manual. How can the user manual is like a novel?
Oh, it's because half of it's in Chinese, look. Keep away from devices and products that can be damaged by strong magnetic fields, e.g. computer hard drives. Think of that. Think of that. Think of selling a gaming chair that's got that warning on it. I know it. I know it means it. Put, don't put it right next. I know it means that. I'm just being funny, or trying at least. Keep pets away. Claws and teeth can damage the upholstery and other soft parts of your chair. Leather wipes. Fabric wipes. I'm not buying the fabric. I'll just get my own fabric wipes from Morrison's. Same thing, won't you? Cactus, hello. We got that quick. Uh, five days. I bought it on the on Christmas Eve. Um, six days even. So I, bu I bought it with um, six days. It did say it would take five days normally. Um, so six is fine, to be honest with you. I never even got a thing about it being dispatched until... Um, Yesterday, last night, about eight o'clock. So, in fact, later than that, I was in bed. It must have been about eleven o'clock. I don't know why I'm reading that. Well, I don't, I'll read it later. A bit of bedtime reading for me. I like this. I really like this. Big bit of card. That's nice, that. Straight in the bin, but... Oh, God. There's 15 steps I've got to follow. 15 steps. I'm going to be terrible at that. Right, here we go. Big bit of acoustic foam there for you. You can stick that on your wall if, you, if you're making a studio, a music studio. It won't do anything, but it'll look like it does something. There's my little tip for you. I spent three years at uni just to learn that. <sighs> fucking hell. The quality of stuff's amazing. I fucking hope so, the amount of money I spent on that. <gasps> okay, that's not coming out. Big chopping block there. No one there, look. Right, pull handles to slide backrest out gently. You can't see this. It says on the it says on the plastic it's wrapped in. Pull handles to slide backrest out gently. If the fucking door goes, I can't get it. I've just realised. Um, so I, I hope nothing turns up today. Yeah. I it's like a yoga block. I'll keep, yeah, I'll keep them for my stretches. It's good that. Nice bit of um. Crap. Right. Is it worth me taking? Right. Okay. Now I'm not going to take every nap at once because that's what you do if you're an idiot. All right. So. It says, step one, on this big bit of card. You just give me a minute, everyone, I'm actually out of breath from, st still from carrying it in here in the first place about half an hour ago. <laughs> it's heavy. This is not something you should do right after Christmas, I'm telling you. Right. Using the handles on the backrest of the oh hang on a second I need to read it properly. Using the handles on the backrest heat seal bag, which is 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 these bits by the way. You got see there's a little handle there. Look, there's one there as well. Um, gently slide the backrest out of the box. Remove all remaining parts and check you've received all the parts against the checklist in the top right. Well, hang on a second, because I, so I have got to take everything out then. Pull the handles to slide the back. I don't understand this. So what, if I just do this, 
bit of this time. That. What? Pull the handles. Using the handles on the backrest heat seal fan. This is step one, everyone. Um, gently slide the backrest out of the box. Oh, out of the box, I've done that. Sorry, that's step one done then. Remove all the remaining parts. Okay, uh, right, I'm halfway through. Sorry, I thought it meant take it out of the bag. It doesn't mean that. Oops, fuck. Lovely bit of um, that there. Hello, Joel. Welcome in. Fuck me. There's your magnetic, it's called the magnetic head pillow system. If you can see that. System. Strong magnet. It's a strong magnet in there. So I uh, don't know what's going to go on with that, but that'll be a laugh. Another big bit of acoustic foam there for you. The magnetic now. Apparently they are, yeah. I enjoyed you lifting it off the ground. Thank you very much, Joel. Uh, I aim to please. Right, now... The post is here, and I'm wondering now... Oh my god. I'm wondering if I'm going to have to sort of... A bit of faff again out of that. Um, right. I'm going to move this. Somewhere for the time being. I'm going to pop it there. That's fine, everyone. That's just my um, radiator. Just because I need to get everything else out first. Just climb out the window. I mean, I'll try and show you my window that I'd have to climb out of. I don't think you'll be able to see it because it's just too light. Um, yeah. <laughs> Never mind. Forget that then. Um, where's Big Bear? Hello, Big Fat Hen. Big Bear is here. Um, oh. Well, he's, he's just there keeping all the instructions warm. That's all. Hello, by the way, welcome in. I uh, hope you're doing good. Right. I don't know which bit to take out next. Because... <laughs> That's attached to something. Oh, it's all attached, look. Right, okay. Is it? Oh, it's not. Hang on. No. Right. Just give me a minute, everyone. Whenever you make a joke, can you use some Seinfeld slap bass? I will, um... Fuck. Did you hear that? That's as good as I can do. Hang on a second. That'll have to do now. There's your, there's your, um, your, your wheel holders. I don't know if it's just me or not. It just feels a little bit wet, this bag. Not entirely sure why. Um, just a bit of a wet bag, I suppose. But that's fine. Um, I, I can survive that. Another bit of acoustic uh, foam there. Get that out. Fucking nightmare. It's going to take me years. I still don't know what they're attached to. Oh, it's attached to all that. 
Right, now this last bit all wants to come out in one go. Which is not good. I haven't got the room to do this, have I? There you go. So that's something. Um, fuck me, the size of that. <laughs> that's the seat. That's the seat. I'll show you that in a bit. That is massive. That is absolutely... <laughs> a couple of more bits of uh, crap there. Lovely stuff. I need to do a checklist, apparently. To make sure they've not forgot to give me everything. I can hardly see, hang on a second. I can hardly see chat at all. For you big bum, thanks Sophie. Look at that. Look at this. That's all just foam. All this, it's like a fucking house. You could live in that. I don't know where to put this now. I've only taken the stuff out of the box and I'm exhausted. I don't know what this is, I almost dropped it then. Don't know what that is, but th this is something. Um, so we'll, we'll be using that at some point, which will be nice. No idea what it is like. And then there's a couple of boxes of uh, crap here. There's some foam armrest tops in there. Which is nice, I'll put them near my lint. My lint chocolate, there you go, lovely stuff. And then, oh, that was just cardboard. This is the uh, accessory box, which will have various uh, bits of crap in it, you'd imagine. Right. <sighs> I'm not going to bed. <sighs> it's heavy. It's heavy stuff. <sighs> Give it a whack so we know it's good quality. <laughs> Yeah, all falls apart. Right. Now it's asking me to lay out the foam sheets on the floor. Presumably so I don't damage the floor. Which means I've got to move that. Here we go. We're gonna we're gonna get going then. We're gonna get going. Um, I've got to move this. I'm gonna put it back in the box actually. Shit, you know. Um, so it's saying to me, put these on the floor. Right, and then you put the wheel bit on top of them, so you're not damaging your floor while you're doing it. Which is good, I, I like that. I like that they've added that as a, as a little thing. Um, that's nice. So we'll pop them there. And then... I can't be honest. Can I send it back? Right. 
It's because I've not got enough space, that's what it is. I might have to commandeer someone else's room for this. I'm going to say Marley for help, please, yes. Just pop the, the bit back in there. Right. First of all, this bit. says put this on the floor there lovely stuff and then it says now you can't see this um place the wheelbase upside down on top of the phone and insert all five casters now i don't know where they are but i'd imagine if i had to make a guess they'd be in the side <laughs> The um, accessories box. You'd imagine. Does Marley have the one on the gamer chair? I have seen Marley on a secret lab. It's madness. Uh, what does this have in it then? Right, this has got PU casters, which must mean they, they smell quite a bit. That's a little joke for you, by the way. Here they are. Though. Right, insert the casters now. That's all they are. Do you want me to move this? Can you see that? Now it doesn't say how you insert them, but I assume you just chuck them in, and they'll be fine or something. Just push. I'm scared of breaking it. I'm scared of breaking it. Have you really got to push? Have you got to push really hard? Because I'm pushing quite hard now. You've got to push really hard. Oh, you fucking shit. I'm too weak. Let me try another one. Let me try this one. Stand on it. Yeah, but I'm not doing it in my socks because they'll get ripped. But standing on it's a good shot. Don't know what I stumbled upon. Hello, Gundalf. Welcome in. Um, let me use these then. For those who don't know what these are, you can't see them. They're my little um, slipper boot things. That I wear when I'm really cold. Oh! Let me pop this on. This will be good. What, and I've just got to do it until I hear a crack or something? You know what, I'll put both on, watch this. You might bend the caster. Right, I'm not standing on it then. My problem is I'm scared of breaking it. Is that it? I can't tell if that's in or not.
and place the wheelbase upside down. Take these fucking things off. As long as it's not loose, once you sit on the chair, they'll probably push him further anyway. That'll shit me up. I feel like they're in, but I can't. That won't go. Hang on a second. You just can't see what I'm doing, I'm sorry. That won't go in further than that. Because it's literally not. You can't even you can't push it in further than that because the metal outside it is bigger than the hole. So you hardly even have to push. So I've fucking done it in the first place, haven't I? And I was just scared that I hadn't done it properly. Because you can't there's a ring around the bottom of it there. There's a ring on the bottom. That ring there is what I was, that's, it's going up to there. You can't put it in further than that because that ring is larger than the hole. So you just got to do that. It's looking easy, man. Right. I'm just worried, you know. This is why I didn't build my own PC or anything like that. Is it in the right one? They have to go into their own bit. It doesn't say that you have to go into their own bit. Kay, are you going to backseat me building a chair, Kay? Because go for it, to be honest with you. Oh, I'm not comfy. You're lying. Mods, if anyone's giving out false information, ban them. It just says there's five casters. It just says there's five... Five casters. Place the wheelbase upside down, top of the foam, and insert all five casters. I'll chuck that there for you. Right. Turn the wheelbase the right side up. Okay, I can do that. There's sweat all over this now. Can I move this? Oh. thing. What's it say? Turn the wheelbase around so up and insert the hydraulic piston. Blimey. It's TOS. Hydraulic piston and sleeve. Okay, nice one. Uh, don't know what that is, so I'll just... What the fuck's that? Oh, they're side covers? Okay. Well, I'll have to put them away for now. Well, hang on. I'm just popping back in there. Sorry, you can't see at all what I'm doing. Can you see this? Yeah, you can, can't you? Is the gain all right? Do you want me to turn the gain up so you can see it a bit better? Or... Or is it all right? I am just asking this, by the way, so I can just take a minute. Is it, is it alright? Because I can't, I can't see my monitor well enough to see if that's... Can you see that? Is it too dark? <laughs> Sorry. It's fine. Nice one. I was just seeing how deep it was, that's all. 
Right. <sighs> hydraulic piston. Now that's not a hydraulic piston. It's a little bit dark, but it's fine. Uh, well, I can't be asked fixing it, so I'm sorry. It'll be fine. Um, so there's your sleeve. There's your green sleeves. Why did I ask? Um, I don't know. So I, so I could just take a minute for myself. That's nice. I need my hydraulic sleeve, everyone. Where's my sleeve? Look at that. Oh, here we go. Big fucking bit of gear, this. It's heavy, that. It's a murder weapon. In a video game. Um. So what way is that going in? Slide the hydraulic sleeve. Oh, insert the hydraulic piston. That just goes in there, I imagine. That doesn't seem right, but I'll go with it. And then you slide the screen over. Apparently it's as simple as that, everyone. He's left with getting the old chair. The old chair is getting chucked in a skip because it's crap. The old, I'm just chucking it away. I can't even sell it. Uh, I said I said um, to my sister, oh, do you reckon anyone will want this? And she went, yeah, I know a few people might have it. And I went, yeah, but sit on it. And she sat on it and she went, nah. It's not comfortable at all. Um, but it's weird because I've sat on it for two years. So it's like, that's what I'm used to. Right, I've done that. Step three is done. Step three of 15, everyone. Step four, remove the four. Oh, for fuck's sake. The four M8 screws pre-installed in the backrest using the hex side of the screwdriver or Allen key. Right, okay, everyone. It's time to get up again. I can't actually get up. Someone take his old chair, make a cast of his ass. Honestly, mate, I'll have to show the, the print on it. Remind me, I'll take a picture of the print on it. It is not a pretty sight. It is like um, the bit of dust there. It's not a pretty sight. Um, fucking hell. All this shit. Fuck. I can't stress how much shit there is in this fucking thing. The backrest, that's the backrest. use a manual for a chair, just sit on it. Right. Oh, I can sit down. Right, I'm going to move this up, everyone. Ooh, hello. Is, is that, is that better? Gamer marks. Yeah, big gamer marks. Massive. I'm knackered. How's my cookie clicker? I can't even be asked to reach my cookie clicker. That's how bad it's got. <sighs> right. The wheels are on. It does roll around, I can confirm. So that's working. Remove the four M8 screws pre-installed in the backrest using the hex side of the screwdriver or allen key. All right. I, I presume the first step is to take it out of its box, out of its wrapping. Now you'd think that they don't put that in because 
it's common sense, but I'm thick. Um, so when I see instructions like this, and it's something expensive in particular, I follow it to the letter. It's like if you said to someone, here's how you make a cup of tea, and you'd maybe go, you know, boil the water, chuck a tea bag in, put the water in, let it brew for a few minutes. With me, if I didn't know how to make a cup of tea, you'd have to go, get a mug, get a kettle, put cold water from the tap into the kettle, put the kettle on the thing the kettle sits on, turn it on, at the, at the plug, on the switch, turn the switch on the plug, and then turn the switch on the kettle. And if it lights up, it's boiling. Good. Now, you need to get a tea bag. If you don't have a tea bag, you've got to go to the shops and buy some. It's, it's, yeah, you, you've got to do that with me. That's my problem. Tim Allen key. Instructions to make ready bread. You need instructions to make, um, fucking Christmas dinner. it with chicken and not turkey like a little fruit. There's your back one. Just in time. Morning Bob. Welcome in. Can you not come on when we're free? Please. Sorry. Sophie. Um, So we've got to take the screws out. Right, hang on a second. Let me read the fucking big bumper book of instructions that I've got. Remove the four M8 screws pre-installed in the backrest using the hex side of the screwdriver or Allen key. Okay. Allen key, who's that? That has got an armrest in. This is the accessories box, which should have an Allen key in it. I don't know what all that was. <laughs> the novelty check. It's like a novelty check, isn't it? <laughs> right, is this the Allen key? Ah, oh, here we are. Oh, it's a proper style one, that as well. I'll keep that. Another bit of um, rubbish for us to um, hold on to. key in there look that's a wait that's not the allen key is it that's the allen key or is that the i don't know what an allen key is but i'll just look at this picture okay it's that big thing remove the m8 screws nice one let's do that then alien key Alan Key. Oh, sorry, I thought you said Alien Key then. Fucking aliens whizzing around him, yet. Right, there's four. Right, okay, I see what it is now. So there's four. There's two here, look. On the. Oh, you can't see what I'm doing. There's two here, and there's two on the other side. Oh, did you see that? Did you say that? Alien Key? So I didn't see that. I was looking what Manic I said. What's this? Desiccant, do not eat, throw away. Ne pas, manger, ajeter. No comer, desechar. 
That's Spanish, I think. Verboden Essen. It doesn't say that, sadly. Unless it says it on the other side. We'll see. Hang on. Well, I don't know why it was stopping at the Allen key to get these out, because you can't. Because <laughs> it's the wrong thing. So, how's it doing that? It's completely the wrong size. The hex side of the screw side. Like, okay. Where's that box that I just had? Does anyone know? Where did that box go? There's a pair of scissors there. Very dangerous. Where did it go? I had a, I had a box. I had a box full of crap. It's gone. Oh, it's down there. <laughs> My mistake, everyone. There we go. Ooh. Grab that. Grab that. There we go. Lovely stuff. Ooh, sit back there. Hello, leopard. Right. Easy. Get rid of these, then. Oh, that's the wrong way, everyone. It's good to just test that to start off with, if you're not sure. Just fucking do it like that, it's easy. Right. That's what I was reading off, it's this little desiccant thing. It's nice. Um, I've got to put all these little screws and stuff somewhere otherwise I'm gonna lose them and that's not good hang on what are these things do I have to keep them oh this next step is gonna freak me out everyone slide the backrest bracket on the right down Onto the right recline bracket, bra bracket. Sorry. Until it comes to a stop, insert the M8 screws previously removed from the backrest. Screw them in halfway. <sighs> Fucking hell! Look, like having a full English on the tube. Oi, oi! It's eleven bong. Right, what am I doing? Put this on the. No, actually, don't do that. It's a terrible idea. Sit it there. Oi, oi. You got a license for that chair? Why do the instructions take up so much space? <laughs> it is mad, isn't it? It is massive. Fifty p for a Red Bull. I mean, fifty p for a Red Bull. Imagine. Am I supposed to take this off? It doesn't say you should do, so I'm not going to do it. Should have got a pink one. I, I was going to get the. Was it called like a frost green or something like that? Sort of like a light minty green colour, which was nice, but then I was sort of a bit like... I'll end up spilling lasagna on it on the first evening. So it's probably not the best thing to be doing. Getting a nice light chair. So I've got a dark one. Free poster. <gasps> Do you reckon? I should just stick it up on the wall. For big, because sometimes when you're building a chair, you get trapped on the other side of the room. Honestly, I think that might be it. I'd rather have the instructions I have for my other chair were just 
um, it, it was just like a little A4 bit of paper with, it didn't even have words on it, it just had pictures and like arrows and stuff and I went, I don't know what I'm doing. And that's why I built it the wrong way around. Right, I've done that. Slide the backrest bracket. Right, I don't know what this is now. Slide the backrest bracket on the right down onto the right recline bracket. I don't know what that means. I assume there are the bits of um, kit that I've got somewhere in the back or whatever. Sorry about that. Fresh piece of rocket? What, like a NASA? Use a player. Use a plate. Yeah, I probably should, shouldn't I? I'm knackered, by the way. Um, I'm just taking a minute. Because I, I, this will actually take me like three hours, by the way. Um, I thought that I genuinely thought to myself when I started this, I thought, what if I've got it done in an hour? It took me an hour to get stuff out of the fucking box. <sighs> the backrest bracket is that a, is that a part? Is that a part? The... Leopard, you built one of these like the other day. Is the backrest bracket a part? Because it doesn't say it is. Magnetic side covers, unless it's that. It's like the backrest bracket on the right. Down. Onto the right recline bracket. Right, so it's already on the chair then. The right. The right. The backrest bracket. The two bits sticking up. Oh, it's on the arse part. Can you just give me one minute while I just clear all this foam and stuff off my bed? Because it's actually pissing me off how much. You can fucking build a house out of it, it's madness. I mean, it's good that they packed it and all that, but like, I, I, I could put stuff on my bed and I'd be a lot more organized. Seeing, watching this is making me want to stream, putting on my shelf. I think DIY, is there a DIY stream thing? Is there a DIY like category that I can have for this? <laughs> so I can have all the DIY experts coming in. Makers and crafting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Do you have a little black bum bag and a good chain to wear on your neck? I don't. Why? Why do you ask? Dangerously close to looking. What do you mean I'm close to looking like The Rock? Have you seen The Rock? You mean Dwayne The Rock Johnson? What about this makes you go? Oh, it looks like The Rock. I'll take it, but um, I've got more hair. A wee white rock. <laughs> my twin. Yeah, my, my twin. Dwayne the, rock. <laughs> Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Yeah. Um. Right, I need to think now. Because I genuinely... I need to move this stuff. Because it's winding me up. Um... Imagine if I built all this and I um, sat on it for the first time and I went, this is crap. Send it back. Do 
So you do have to, it is, it is. Yeah, it is, um. So I'm looking at the safety information for it and it's just saying don't don't use the chair with more than one person. Don't push the chair around when someone's sat in it. Don't push down on the backrest when a person's reclined. This chair should only be used as intended and in a non-abusive manner. Manner. I can't read. <sighs> you need a shower. Leopard, I will be exactly, I'll be in exactly the same place when you're done. Um. Where did the channel points go? I got rid of them. I get bored of them sometimes and I just get rid of them. Sorry. Right. Okay, I'm gonna be back in. I am so bright. What is up with that? Get that turned down a bit. That's a bit better. That's better, isn't it? Is that better? Oh, that's miles better. Look at that. Hello. Um, fair enough. Yeah, I, I, I just get bored of them. Do you know what I mean? Right. I'm gonna move all this. Crap here. I can't get out of my room. Okay, well I can't get that room, so hang on. I'm sure that was nothing. Are you are you just gonna be alright by um, by yourself for about a minute? I'm gonna move this stuff. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this size of it. It's like a puzzle piece from the crystal maze. Do you know what it smells like? Do you know, did anyone ever buy, do you know one chill, is it children? No, Red Nose Day. Do you remember Red Nose Day? You used to get the foam red nose for charity. This is an English thing, by the way, or a British thing at least. And you had that new foam smell. And you used to put it on your nose, obviously, because it's a red nose. Um, it's like that. It's nice. It's nostalgic. So where... I 
Can I use the same deodorant as a celeb? Oh, do you use the purple, the purple one or the blue one? Because I've got two on there. Do you use the purple one or the blue one? I've got two on there at the moment. Don't know why I'm talking about this. I'm gonna jump on your bed with my shoes on. Go for it. I don't care. I don't care. Put all your crap in there. Put all the crap in there. Need some sleep? Have a lurk and talk to everyone later. V, thank you very much for, for being here. Thank you. Have a good sleep. I uh, appreciate that. Appreciate you coming in here. Um, have a good one. Is it sure white marks? It's sure active dry. It's the purple one. I didn't buy this. And I got given this one for Christmas. I got given this one for Christmas off my grandma. It's L'Oreal Cool Power. Um, ice Effect with Cryo Caps TM technology. Fucking bollocks. I'm turning that around by the way, so I'm not sponsored by them. Which one do you use, Bob? I've got a pack of six of something down there, because I, I buy them in bulk. There's a pack, Nivea. Nivea Invisible. Because I buy them in bulk. You get like six for like seven quid or whatever. Men's no white marks, just black and white. All right, shape my son. Uh, I know which one you're talking about, but it's a good one. The, the invisible ones are a good one. A good ones because you like to see you don't get those marks on. Right. So I've got to take this out of its wrapping now. Heavy. Right, turn it round. Hey. It's all taped up. Terrible scissors. <sighs> Get on with it, mate. Could be done by now. I know. It is big, isn't it? <laughs> it's huge! <laughs> yeah, it's a big one, that. myself on the instruction manual for the chair which is a, a very large instruction manual considering it's a chair it's resistant just stick that on anything for a laugh. Read before assembly. Oh, hang on a second. What does it say? 
Do not remove this strap until the back seat has been securely installed. Good thing I read that because I was about to remove it and then read it. That's the seat. That's the seat. <laughs> That's the seat. Now, what's the front of it and where, what's the back? Because this is the problem I had last time. Well, I, well no, actually, that's the back because they're there. Fight heavy. Right. Where's the instructions? Two arses on that, I know. Right, I reckon I should do this on my bed now. I feel like that's a, a, a safer option for me. <sighs> Fuck me, where's that, where's the instructions? Slide the backrest bracket on the right down onto the right recline bracket until it comes to a stop. What the fuck does that mean? A resub. How no, kind of you. you much, I am months. forever in your debt. Behold. <laughs> Thank you very much, mate. I really appreciate that. Hello, welcome in. You now have a new um, sub badge. And all that. Make the most of it. Thank you very much, mate. Show it off to all your mates. All of them. Turn that down a bit. There you go. It's a bit better, isn't it? How are you doing? Do the instructions also function as a wobble board? Mr. Random, I almost did that, and then I went, probably shouldn't do that. Probably shouldn't do that these days. Um, but yes, I think they would do. <sighs> Hello chums, how's it going? Um, mate, I've been here for one hour and 16 minutes, and I'm on step five of 15. So, how do you think it's going? So we should be done. We should be done by three hours and 45 minutes. <laughs> three hours and 45 minutes it should take. Going on that average. Right, I don't quite understand this, but I'm gonna give it a go. I'm gonna do it this way round. And it reads as follows. The, the scripture reads as follows. Slide the backrest bracket on the right down onto the right recline bracket until it comes to a stop. Insert the M8 screws previously removed from the backrest. Screw them in halfway. I can do that. You could buy a chair and have it delivered and have it built by the time you're done here. Tall nerve, mate. Why do you go click some cookies? Insult doesn't work if I do it as well, does it? The backrest bracket down onto the right recline bracket. I was talking to someone about this uh, not too long ago, maybe not even a week ago, about how when I read instructions and stuff like that, those words are all words that I know. Right. And I can read it and it's fine, but I can't process that. D does that sort of make sense? It's, it's words in an order, but I can't make sense of it. Slide the backrest bracket on the right down onto the right recline bracket.
I think I get it, but I'm gonna give it a go. We're going to the non aliens now. Nice. I've I'm in the quadrillions at the moment. I got my grandma apocalypse um, on the go as well, which was nice. Right. Can you see this? Not really. Hang on. Fucking move, big bear. There. Oh, you can see that now. That's fine. See that there? See that? That's got to go onto there. And then you put the screws back in. in there and there. You want 200 mil? Is the best way to make cookies just buy everything? To an extent, to an extent, you might be better off asking um, Tall Nerd. Get the Grandma Apocalypse when you can, it's good. Bit spooky like, but it's good. So, I don't know if you can see this now. That's slid in to there. Upgrades to your most effective buildings and milk upgrades, yes. It goes up very quickly, Bob. It goes up very quickly. So, you just can't see this properly, but there's two things in there now, and I need to stick those screws that I got rid of, I need to put them back in there. Only halfway. Only halfway. Crouching like a little gnoblin. But yeah. Oy. Don't do that, you fucking idiot. Only halfway. There you go. Only halfway. Only halfway, mate. Only halfway. No point doing it the full way. Only halfway. My right, lemon's not going in. So what's the problem there then? I think I've pushed it in properly, hang on. I don't get why this isn't going in. Ooh. Chuck that in there. Just chuck that in there, mate. It's not a problem. Wonky. Can't be wonky, can it? I'm trying to make sure it doesn't. I'm gonna have to do it like that, aren't I? Actually. So I was just making sure I'm screwing it the right way. Look the contextless audio for this. Someone can probably clip it and just turn it into an audio file. Wouldn't be a problem. Right. Let me take this one out. 
I'm going back half a step, everyone. Just take this one out and pop it in there. <laughs> Fuck. That's not right. I don't think I've slid it on properly. But I have, <laughs> I have done, I've not, it is a little bit wonky and that's why it's not going in. So can I undo that? Oh, I can. Can I put it back on there now? Will it help the watch? I know what's up with it, but I, I know what's up with it. Just a fully fucking falling down the back and oh, Christ. Take it off and just put it on again. That's it. Got it. Get that in there now. 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 Fuck. I think I need to do it, like... On my knee. I think I need to do it on my knee. Oh, fuck me, it's heavy. Leave the screws out, what could go wrong? Tempting, mate. Oh, no, that's gone. Never anyway, mind. I need to do this on the floor. <sighs> Step five, everyone. I, I, I need to do that toll nerd, yeah, but the problem is doing it on the bed wasn't working because it was... The weight of it was moving the, the, the connection slightly off so I couldn't stick the screws in properly. God knows what that is. Broken man. <sighs> One hour twenty seven. One hour twenty seven. Should have timed this really, shouldn't I? <sighs> have a look at the video. I know what to do, Tall Nerd, but it's the it's the way I need to get it into place that is confusing me. Because I haven't got the, it's the, I haven't got the space. I haven't got the space is the problem. Can we come help? I fucking wish, mate. I wish.
That's not even going on now. Where's the... Oh, I fucking hate this. I don't think that's going to work, but I'll give it a go. Nah, it's not going in. I can see it's slightly wonky. Get rid of this fucking thing. Don't need that till the end, do I? Could the box go behind the backrest so it's propped up? That's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm thinking. But then if I put the box there, put the chair there, I've got no room. And I say I've got room. I've got to put this down here. There's already no space to put this down here. I've got a new plan. What if I, if I tip that like that? If I tip that like that? Because the seat needs to be flat, I know. Unless I just put my foot on the seat while I do it. But then I haven't got the space, that's the problem. If I had, if I had a fucking box, if I have the box, I'd be fine. I hate it so much. It winds me up. I can't do it. Put it in the bin. If 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 they had a thing, it was like, oh, it costs like sixty quid, and someone will come and build it for you. Fucking take it every day. Now, that's fine, but I can't put the screws in there because there's no room. So I'm going to flip it over here. All right, I'm going to flip it over like that. I'm going to push it down like that. And I've got it now. So let's get this screw in. Have I got it in? Yes, I have. Yes, I have. Have I? That's not right. That's not right at all. That's not, it's not going in. Cause it's, the, it's ever so slightly off. But I don't know how you would ever, unless you just have to, oh, see now, I've got a push. Like that, while I do it, and it'll go in. Got it now. Got it now. I'm having to push while I do it. I'm having to push the headrest against the seat like that, push them together really hard, otherwise he won't go in. Probably got to do the same with this one now. He says, as this one doesn't want to go in. Oh, there you go. Get in there, mate. Step six. <laughs> <laughs> Put 
Push the left recline bracket to align with the screw holes on the left of the backrest. You can see at the physically itchy stage of irritation, Joel, I am itchy, my back is itching me. Um, I'm sweating. I'm going on every five minutes now. Um, <laughs> I fucking hate this. I, I can't explain to you just how much I hate building stuff and following instructions. It's not what I'm built for. I can't do it. I just do it. It's like when I want to play a tutorial in the game, I just skip it and do my own thing. And then, it, you know, if, if I fuck up, it's my fault. So I've got to flip this round now. Which I don't think I've actually got the energy to do. Um. Oh, we'll give it a go! Oh my god. Do you know what? I'm going to do this a different way. I'm just going to do this up here, look. Because half of it's screwed in now, so it should be fine. Push the left recline bracket to align the screw holes, insert the United screws. Yabba jabba do! Thanks for the coffee! Oh! Thank you for the fiver, um, coffee supporter. Doing great, son. Keep it all up. We're all proud of you. Thank you very much. I very much do appreciate that. It's very kind of you. That's paid for the shipping. Need a drink. Thank you very much. Thank you. Fuck this. Fuck and heavy. Where's my key? I don't know if you can see this. This bit here now has to align with. Oh, fucking hell. It's going to be another case of pushing it in manually while. How are you meant to do that? It's asking you to do three things at once here. So you hold, I'm going to hold that like that. And I've got to push this in like that, and then when it's connected, you just... But how are you meant to... You need two people for this. You actually need two people for this. Because you're having to push the chair in and also screw it at the same time, which is impossible for one person to do. And if anyone goes, well, I did it, I did it by myself. You see this? I've already done it once. Yeah, this is different though, because... Yeah, it's different because we're closer to a mental breakdown now. I should point out, this has got nothing to do with the people at Secret Lab writing shitty instructions or having to, me to build a chair and shit. This is entirely on me. This is entirely on me. I just can't do this. I haven't got the space and I haven't got the brain or the physical capabilities. So... I'm getting up. Ugh. I'm going to do it like this. I'm going to do it like this. So I can... Look away everyone, please. 
for your own sake. That's in. <laughs> That's in. Now there's one more. Right, that's that. That's that done. Chair building sim. Oh, I'd love that. Install the magnetic side covers. But hang on a second. Oh, then tighten all four. I was gonna say. At no point did it go. Yeah, you got tightening now. But it does. Should that have made that noise? Should that have made that noise? I feel like those noises shouldn't have happened. If I'm being honest with you. Is there still music, by the way? There should be. I'm not tightening it too much. I'm, I'm worried. I'm very worried about this one. I'm very worried about that one. Doesn't look like it's going in on the right angle. But we'll have to see what happens. Not too hard, mate, not too hard. That's fine, That's fine mate. Install the magnetic side covers by aligning them on top of the backrest brackets. They will snap magnetically in place, everyone. Where are they? They near? magnetic side covers. Is it really dark? I'm sorry for his. 
I think you've either got my you've either got my face being really white and everything else fine, or my face fine and everything else really dark. So how do you know which ones are? How do you know which ones are the right and which ones are left? How do you know which one's the right and which one's the left? Install magnetic side covers by aligning them on top of the backrest brackets. They will snap magnetically in place. I understand that, but... If that's the left one and the left one... Hang on. The left one. Does it say on them? No. There's, there's not... Well, I thought that, Bob. I thought they were headphones or something, but it doesn't seem like this. The way I see it is if that's like that, I'll do the left. I think they can go either side. The mirrored though, the mirrored and that worries me because if they weren't, if they were, if it were just the same shape, it'd be fine. But the mirrored, which means one's surely meant to go on one side. Or, you know, there's, there's a logic to that at least. Oh, yeah. Okay. Now then, I think I get it now. That one goes on there. Lovely stuff. Ooh. It does snap into place. That's nice, that. Okay. Okay, sorted. Step eight, everyone. Remove the reclined strap. Okay. Where is the any key? Oh. That was pleasing. What was? Oh, the magnetic thing snapping on. It's nice, isn't it? It's a very strong magnet as well. Happy about that. Going to turn it off a bit more again, look. Just so you can see what I'm doing. Where am I? Use the Phillips screwdriver to remove the red screw marked out by the red safety tab. Welcome in. New seat. It's a secret lab, mate. It's a secret lab. Very nice. Um, I'm going to do this on the floor. Because otherwise I can't really see what I'm doing at this point. And I need to for this because it's a safety thing. Instructions, look at that. Hello, Dabupi. Welcome in. How's it going? 
use the Phillips screwdriver to remove the red screw marked out by the red safety tab on the right recline. What? Oh, that! So I've got to take it out? Why don't you take that out? That's in the way. That's not a safe thing. Hang on. I'm using the wrong thing here, I just realised. Where's that? Oh, it's there. I'm meant to be using this, you fucking idiots. <laughs> I'm sat there using that. It's got nothing in it. There you go, look at that. There you go. I swear to God, this is why. There was no thing in the instruction manual that said you had to do that. Which is, uh, this is what I mean. I'm really daft when it comes to this sort of thing. It's not coming out now. Ah, look at that. So there's your red safety tab. It says don't get rid of that, so I'm not getting rid of it. Uh, one or two of the movies book and TV shows I've seen over the years suggest staying away from the secret lab might be the best course of action. <laughs> get turned into a mini Swiss. One <laughs> tenth of your real size. Mate, this chair will make me feel like I'm one tenth of my real size. It's absolutely massive. It's like a sofa. That's not instructions, that's the free poster. I mean, <laughs> yeah, I might hang it up. I might hang it up, you know. Morning, Si, I'm a bit lurky while I wake up. Um, hello. Hi. Have a good look. Um, I'm sure I'll still be doing this. I mean, we're one hour 51 in now, uh, and I'm on step nine. No, I'm not. I'm on step 10, everyone. Step 10 of 15, and we're about two hours in. So, should be done by about two and a half, three hours, I think. Um, now then. Lift the chair and gently set it facing downwards. No problem. It doesn't even have to put anything in there. Is it just an empty? Oh, okay, fair enough. It's just an empty thing, isn't it? When I finish this, by the way, and I put the VOD on YouTube, do you reckon there'll be people who will watch this video because they've searched like how to build a secret lab chair? and they'll watch this whole video. If anyone's watching this video right now on YouTube, because cause I've done, because I've, because you've done that, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm really sorry. But I hope it makes you feel better that you're doing this better than I am. I've got to flip it over everyone. Like this. It says gently set it down. Gently now, gently, gently, gently. Gently, gently, there you go. Lovely stuff, right. Oh my God. That was step 10, right, that's one step. So that's fine. Welcome the people who potentially also taken one hour 51. Yeah, it's, it's nice to have you along for the ride. Um. Okay, I need to swivel this round. Otherwise, I'm not going to have the space, I don't think. Blimey. Blimey. a bit better. Well, actually, probably not. It 
to be dark in here. I think I need a light one. I think I need a light one in here. Refer to the sticker label under the seat base for the correct orientation. Okay. Line up the grooves on the inside of the lever hand. Oh, fucking hell. It gets techy now. Where's that weird bit? It's here. It's all fucking goop inside it. wet it's actually wet I can, can I show you this this is actually wet look at that <laughs> it's actually wet hello Robbie welcome in thank you very much mate welcome in hope you're having a, a good time fluids game of grease I don't know what it is I'm sure it'll be fine, like, right? but... So... Your tilt lock is on the left and your height's on the right. Now, where are they? They should be in here. Ah! My like little hockey, my like little hockey things, aren't they? We could have a few guesses. Yeah. Has anyone anyone heard of who was it? I said earlier who delivered this. Was it X XDP or something or XPD? I think XDP. Anyone ever heard of that company before? Because I've never heard of them, and I was terrified because I googled them and. Everyone was going, the shit. But they always do that with delivery companies, don't they? So. so that's your tilt lock. So your tilt lock's going on the left. Eggs DP. Are these those streaming fluids? I think it might be, you know. Let's take all that off. Um, refer to the sticker label for the print orientation of the tilt levers. Line up the grooves on the inside of the lever handles with the notches and insert fully into the shafts. Imagine leaving a review for Hermes, like, yeah, it came. That's the thing, isn't it? Only, people only ever leave reviews for them if something terrible's happened. That's the problem. Is that right? Oh, no, that was right. Okay, and the same for this one. This is your, your height. Did someone say shaft? A sloth? Speaking of shafts, hello, mate. Welcome in. Fancy seeing you here, mate. Hope you're, hope you're doing well. There you go. Lovely. Um, ensure the tilt mechanism is facing the correct direction by referring to the same stick label under the seat base. Attach the tilt mechanism to the bottom of the seat base using the four M8 screws. Now then. Really good. I'm glad to hear it, mate. How goes the build? Mate, I hate this. I hate this. I hate it. I can't follow instructions to save my life. We've been two hours now, and to be fair, we've actually made a lot of progress, but I was stuck on step five for about an hour. Um, it was madness, I couldn't do it. I could not do it. So I've got to put this now on there, which you can't really see, um, but that's fine, I think. 
And then I've got a sticker on with, excuse me, with some um, M8 screws, which uh, I think they've given me some more of somewhere. I know they have given me some more, I just don't know where they are. Um, unless there's some already in here, or are there some already in? No. The last chair that I got actually came with the M8 screws in there, so you actually got spares. This one doesn't seem as if it's given me spares, but they're all in there, look. Now I'm wondering if I can turn this chair around 90 degrees. I don't know if it'll fit, but that would make my life. If that works, by the way, one, I'm a genius, and two, this is going to be ten times easier if this fits like this. Fucking hell. Oh, fucking hell. Oh. oh. Perfect. Right. Lovely. So I can have that like that now. Um. Oh, let me turn the gain up a bit. You can't see what I'm doing. Is that a bit better? So I just need to stick this on here, four screws in there, and then the armrests, and then I'm done. I believe. Oh, and I've got to stick the, <laughs> I've got to stick the wheels on as well. Make sure it's not backwards. Exactly. Um, it says here, this is how you're meant to do it. So you, I've, I've done this bit, and you're just meant to stick it on, like that. Alright. I don't know why this is wet. I don't understand what these fluids are. Um, <laughs> I might just tweet it, and I just go, does anyone else get a secret lab chair and it was wet when it turned off? That's a bit weird, isn't it? Like water. I don't know what it is, Robbie. It, it it's some sort of. I don't know what it is. Can you see it? Can you see it? You just see all this here. Look. It's just all wet. I can't tell what it is exactly, but. No idea. Right, I've got to stick the things on here then. It's probably the easiest bit of it. It's the blood of the last person who tried building it. Could be oil. It's not oil hoops, because I've I can tell when it's oil. It's definitely not oil. Um but that was my first guess actually. Hello hoops by the way. That was my first guess. But nah, it's not oil. You can tell when it's oil. And that ain't oil. Is the music on, by the way? Is it really? Is there some nice quiet music going on in the background? Because there should be. Oh, we get these out. Cracking. Yes. Okay. Good. You aren't going to get a stream like this for a while, hopefully. Because <laughs> if I have to buy another chair in the next 10 years, I'm going to be pissed off. Hope it breaks, no offence, because I love streams like this. <laughs> That's fair. That is fair, honestly. Oh, if there were more things for me to build, I'd build them on stream, because it is a laugh. And if I was doing this by myself, I would have... Honestly, if I was doing this by myself, I would have given up now. I would have given up a long time ago, because... I can't do it. 
I can't, I can't do it by myself. I can barely do it with God knows how many people watching. And like being able to help out in that. I'm leaving all the stickers on it, by the way, just in case. Right, that looks like that's done then. Um, lift the assembled wheelbase and insert the hydraulic piston into the socket of the tilt mechanism. Ooh, uh. Now then, I have to do... Now, this is on my knee, so... The hardest bit is going to be when I have to flip this all over. Okay, hang on a second, everyone. bit on there that I was meant to, there you go. That's just meant to go on there like that and it'll stay there, but you've got to, I've got to hold that obviously. Now, what's it saying? Insert the hydraulic piston into the socket of the tilt mechanism. I mean, is that inserted enough or do we need to insert it even more? Carefully tilt the chair. Now, hang on. Oh yeah, the fucking armrests are already on it. I didn't even realise. <laughs> I thought I had to install the armrests, but they're already on it. I was like, hang on, I've not done the armrests yet. My other one, I had to do the armrests manually. Hello, Kate, by the way. So I've got to now flip this. Is that in? I think that's in. But it's not getting more in than that. That fucking box is massive. And then it's just the, the armrests and then that's it. I'm done. How many mommies does it take to build a chair? More than one, clearly. More than one. Leopard, it was wet. Leopard, the the bot, the the this bit here, it was just wet. I don't know why, but it was just wet. I like gamer fluids all over it. I was very confused by it. Right, I've got to flip this over, which is when I finally realised just how heavy it actually is. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is heavy. Right. Oh, that's something. Clang. Yeah, that wasn't good, was it? There you go. Done. Now, can I unrecline this? Please don't make a weird noise. Oh, it's smooth. Oh, I like that. Wait, I'm gonna sit on it, everyone. Are you ready? My first sit down, because I can do these bits sat down. My first sit down on the secret lab chair. Let me get these first, actually. Hang on. Now, which one's which again? Do they go at the front? I imagine they do. The, the magnets. Huge fan of that. 
Ooh. Fuck me, that's a big chair. That's a big chair. And it didn't make a noise. Do you know, that's the first time I've sat on a chair in my room in over two years where I've sat down and it's not going. Do you just want to stream or I just sit here like this? What an angle. <laughs> Sorry. Let me use this a bit. Ooh. 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 There's a bit of rock in there. That's fine. I haven't put the headrest on. I need to do that. So we've got a magnetic head pillow. Um, which I think is quite interesting. Camera on the ground, please. You will get that. I've got to move everything first, but then we'll we'll uh, we'll do that for sure. Neo Dynamo magnets can interfere with pacemakers and other implanted medical devices. We recommend consulting your physician and medical advice device manufacturer for information specific to your medical device and whether you should need to maintain a minimum distance between your medical device and our product. I don't have a magnetic chair head, sorry, yet. Terrible habit of not opening things properly. Terrible, terrible habit. By the way, there is still something on the this thing, by the way, that I've not taken off by accident. I'll do it in a bit. Here's your little... Here's your little magnet. Look. That noise was meant to happen. <laughs> oh, I like that. What I won't like is the fact that if I move it down too low, it's going to fall off. And that'll annoy me. But no, that's the right height. Ooh. No, it's not. That's the right height. Ooh. Chair unboxing. Hello, Jules. Gotta go off shopping with Miss Is Nerd. Enjoy the big expensive seat. Thank you very much, Tall Nerd. Thanks for giving me um, some company. Thank you very much. I think folk with hearing aids or something get the head stuck to my. I don't think it's that strong. It says pacemakers, but. I don't know. I learned that some people play FPS games and they hold their mouse like this the whole oh shit i've just closed i've just closed chat hang on a second everyone and the music as well <laughs> just give me one moment people play like that people play like that it's madness fucking idiots leopard i can still i can still see chat on chatbot with claw machines in their hands, it's madness, isn't it? Because the weirdo, it's hello, Persuader Tron, welcome in. Should have got a wheel. They're still so expensive, mate. They're still really expensive. I know this was expensive, but like, I sit in it. A wheel, the ones I'm looking at are still like double what they were a year ago. It's madness. I'm gonna move this. Back up here. Now you'll notice I haven't got my lighting set up, so I'm sorry about that. Oh, here you go. Tab it better. <sighs> Fucking hell. You got a Corsair Qatar, lovely normal mouse, very nice. I got um, I got a new. Did I say this? I got a new keyboard the other day. I bought a new keyboard. It's not turned up yet, but 
I don't know when it's going to turn up because it hasn't. It's not even in stock, but I've ordered it just in case. Snap it there. How does it feel? It's very nice. I sat in it and um, it didn't make a noise, <laughs> which is it passes my test, I think. I look a bit blurry. There you are, it's better, isn't it? Hello. Does it have a DJ button? Sadly not, Mr. Random. I was looking at those kinds of keyboards as well. I like a musical one. Um, but I didn't, I didn't get one. I've spent a lot of money on this chair, so I'm sort of like, right, just hold off for a while. You don't need it. It's making a slight rocking when you do that. But I think that's just what chairs do, isn't it? What keyboard is it? It's a Corsair. Uh, K55 Pro. K55 RGB Pro. Um, it was 55 quid, but I got it half price. It's just, it's just a standard. It's not mechanical or anything like that, because they're shite, but... I mean, they're not shite, but I don't like them. Um, so that that's what I got. It's, a key, it's just a keyboard, isn't it? It's a better one than the one I've got at the moment. Um, is what I'd say. It comes with a nice little wrist rest and stuff as well. Um, so, you know, that's fine. Too used to laptops and touchpads. Don't even know what finger click... What finger click with what on a mouse. I was like that when I used a laptop for so long. To be honest. Um, Stephen, hello, welcome in. Easy to put the chair together. It's together. It's together. Um, I'm going to just... Can I just fix this? Uh, sorry, there you go. You want to hear my weird breathing noises and stuff? It's fixed. It's it's fixed. It's together. It was a faff, mate. I'm bad at following instructions. Um, but it is done. Um... 37 and 37 kilograms i think it was v 30 that's what the box was take away some other stuff in it it's probably about 30 35 kilograms 35 kilograms i'd say um well we're talking about keyboards and peripherals anyone got any camera or mic rex i cannot recommend enough the wave 3 elgato wave 3 it does cost quite a bit but i think you can get it maybe on sale for about 100 um Elgato Wave 3 with the software, the VST software. So what I'm doing at the moment is I'm moving. I've not done it at the moment, but I use a noise gate and noise suppression and stuff in OBS as a filter. I'm moving all that over to Wave to the Wavelink software because it's got VST support and stuff. Um, so I'll be doing that at some point, and I can just I can just get it more how I want it because VST is generally a, a you can just run it all through one bit of software. It's very good. Um, I do recommend it. Due to a recent update, the Wave mic is, the no, is a no-brainer for anyone who streams. Absolutely. So I've got one. Out with... You said you've got one. Um, Nightlight has one. A couple of other people have one. I think... Did Bob get one? On, or is that Bob got the face cam? I want the Elgato face cam. Um, it's quite expensive at the moment. It's 180-odd quid. Um, don't get the Logitech C920. Because that's what that is. And it's a fucking pain in the ass. Um, don't bother. Razer Kio. Razer, so I, when I was getting my first webcam, it was either going to be the Kio or the C920. And I went, well, I've heard of Logitech, so I'll just get that. I, I wouldn't recommend it to anyone. Use a blue snowball. It's a good entry level affordable mic. The, the blue snowball. Now, I've, I my first streaming mic was a blue snowball. It depends on what you want to spend. If you're going to get a blue, you're probably better off getting a Yeti than a snowball. Not only does I think it looks better, but I just think it's a little bit better. But um, I think when people... Uh, 
there's this sort of like thing with streamers and they go, oh, I'm just starting streaming or whatever. What's a good like mic webcam combo? I think the most common sort of answer I've seen to that is the C920 webcam and the Blue Yeti mic. And it's like, they will do the job, but I think even for the price you're spending on those, there's probably a better combo that you could get. But also, if you just spend a little bit more, if you can, obviously, um, the choices become, like, infinitely better. That's what I'd say. Um, running your audio through any dedicated sound card, like the one in the Wave is the Dream, yeah, it's it's good. I've, I've not used it for a lot of other stuff yet. I've not used it to run any other set of sounds through anything like that, but... I probably will do at some point. 20 quid camera from Amazon. It's really good. Honestly, sometimes those cameras are better than like, like you say, like C920s and stuff like that. 80, 20, 20. That's a good one. That was on my, um, like, I was looking at that one when I was, when I was looking for, for mics. So there was that one. There was the HyperX Quadcast. Something. Um, you know the one. Uh, that was also on my, on my list. Um, there was a couple of others. But I watched a YouTube video where it basically compares a load of mics. It's just someone talking. And you just hear them one after the other. And uh, Wave 3. with these are, these are like with no EQs or anything like that on them. Just like as they are on like 50% gain or whatever. The Wave 3 was just for the price. Um better than the rest of them i think but it, i suppose it depends on what you're looking for but the wavelength it comes with wave um three comes with software free software and it's really good so that that's why i'd recommend that any cameras was looking at the razor one with the ring light but again i'd rather have stuff separate um how much are you wanting to spend the one the webcam i want to get is the um, the Elgato phase cam, but it's just expensive. It's 180 odd quid. Is it? How much? 174.95 at the moment. Sorry, it's five quid off at the moment. Um, but your webcam's only most of the time small in a corner, so I wouldn't say that was the most important thing. I'd say get a good mic first. And then your webcam is sort of almost like an afterthought. Um, Logitech Stream Cam and Brio. I was looking at the Stream Cam and I know someone that had a Brio, but they had to send it back because it just didn't seem to be very good. I don't know if it was broken or something, but I remember them using it to stream and I was like, this is a 4K webcam. It was, it was like... This is this was better than it. I don't have to set it up wrong. They got it. They sent it back anyway and got a different one. Um, I don't know. As long as your cam's 1080, yeah. Mine, so mine's 1080. Mine's 1080 30. Um, which is fine for what I do. 1080 60 is always nice, but you don't, you know, don't need it, do you? Don't need it. Unless you're doing like streams where you a lot of your stuff is just like your webcam. Whereas I play a lot of games and stuff, my webcam's just in the corner, no one looks at it. Do you know what I mean? Um due to the virus, the former camera gatekeeping is gone, or the newest ranges from Canon Nikon and so on have streaming modes, yeah. Um I know someone that uses a maybe it's Sony. Or something like that. Um, like an actual camera. Um, and they just they just use that. They use it for vlogging. And they also use it for streaming. It's fantastic. So if you've actually got... If you're actually looking to get like a camera. Just get one of them. I saw an advert for a webcam. That's meant to be like... The, the world's first webcam. That's like digital camera quality. Or something like that. And... I can't remember what it was called now. And I looked at it and I went, that's all right. I'd probably spend 150 quid on that or something like that. It was fucking like 400 quid. 
can't remember what it was called. And the, and the software that comes with it is like a, a subscription. Subscription based. And it's just like, no. <laughs> no. No. It's not worth it. Unless, like, you're... I don't know what you'd need to be doing to do... You'd have to be, like, a proper pro streamer to um to bother getting something like that. You know what I mean? Hello, Nightlights. Welcome in. How you doing? Lovely to see you. Just looked up the receipt. My webcam cost me 60 quid. Do not remember it being that expensive. That I mean, this one was about 60 quid. Um, I should point out, this isn't a bad webcam, but I do think that for 60 quid, you can get better. I have to faff about with the gain and stuff and the, the focus and the exposure and stuff every time I log onto OBS. Every time. Um, there is dedicated software, Logitech software, where you can just set it and it, it's fine, but it doesn't work. And it sucks up your CPU like uh, God knows what. $25 Logitech suits me just fine. It, yeah, exactly. I know I know people that have like pretty, I wouldn't say crap webcams, but just like cheap ones, like your 20, 20 quid Amazon ones or whatever. Um, it's fine. They do, they do, they do the job. Do you know what I mean? Well, because I want to do proper art streams. I want a good quality cam that sees every baby tear. Yeah, that's fair. But you need it. You'd need a. All you need is one that's the at max whatever resolution you're streaming at. So if you're streaming at 1080, you just need a 1080 one. Because if you're getting a 1080 one, or a 4K one, for example, and you're only streaming at 720, then it's not even going to come through. There's no point. Yeah, or you can use your phone as well. That is a, that is an option. You can use your phone. Is that meant to wobble like that? There's a button here on the armrest, and I don't know what it does. It's fine. Do I see a massive instruction manual behind you? You certainly do, mate. Look at the fucking size of it. <laughs> It's bigger every time I look at it. <laughs> it is massive. It is ridiculous, isn't it? I'll tell you what, though. It works. Um, I'm going to have to end a bit early today. I'm not ending right now. I don't think we'll have a chat and stuff like that. I don't think I'll be playing anything. I can't be asked. Um, but I need to clear all this crap up. There's shit all over my bed. It's a fucking massive box that it came in. I mean... I don't know what I'm going to do with that box. It's a, it's a big box. Going to go again. Got to pack stuff. Going away for New Year. Take care. Thank you for being here. And thank you very much. Have a good one. Rage, you need to give me any Secret Lab stickers. Did, I didn't get any, as far as I'm aware. Nightlights, who did yours get delivered by? I know you live in Ireland, so you might have a different company, but... Just in case. I got mine delivered by... What are they called again? I need to find it again. XDP Express. TNT. Oh, you got TNT. I got XDP, who I've never heard of until now. XD you Google XDP and the tr first thing is a trust pilot. Rating 2.6. But people only rate it because... People only go on trust pilot to rate things badly. Does anyone go on trust pilot and go give someone like a good rating? XDP are fine. I'm sure they are. I got a bit worried though because it was a company I've never heard of. And um, I just sort of shat it a bit. And it, I mean, maybe I have had stuff delivered by XDP, but I've not realized. Because they don't have like an XDP van. It was like just a fella in a white van. I've fucking props to the fella, by the way. He carried that from his van up to my house. It's in my house. Up to the house. Um, and I, he, he gave it to me and he, he popped it on the doorstep. 
And I went, cheers. And I fucking tried pulling it in, and I couldn't. <laughs> I fucking about five minutes getting it through the porch. It's madness. Guy okay, came with mine, said he was a freelancer, and then he goes and takes as many passes as he feels like and works nine to one every day. That's fair. That's fair. Maybe they do something like that then. So I'm just looking at the logistics page, don't know why. Um it's, it's nice sitting in the chair, by the way, and just um Hang on. Can I get this working? I don't think this game works on the auto game catcher. For whatever reason. I thought anyone's tried it because no one fucking streams cookie clicker. Um, sounds like good work if you can get it. Yeah, I can imagine. My mate Ted does that. He got himself a strangely tall van recently. Interesting. Are you happy or still stressed? I'm all right. I'm all right, night. Um, I'm calm now. I'm I'm in my chair. It's a big chair. It's a very very large chair. I'm going to fall asleep in this tonight. I'm telling you. Um, Monkey Click is class, mate. <laughs> it's fucking great. I'm well into it now. I've got my little uh, wrinklers, Henry wrinklers. Um, eating my cookies up for me. It's good. The arts end of Nowhere Island's probably happy for any drivers they can find. That's true. Also, probably quite a nice view as well. The name's a dog laughing with its tongue out. I'm sure it's deliberate. What is... Sorry, Persuaded Tron. The name's a dog laughing with its tongue out. OXDP. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Wonderland, by the way. Welcome in. How's it going? I think he's a Glazers fan. A gla oh, has a rack thing on the side. Oh, I see. <laughs> That's fantastic, though. I mean, if it, if it does the job, it does the job, doesn't it? Two big XL boys. It's fantastic night lights. I no longer feel confined in my seat. Oh, I've got a cookie of ref. Nice one. Um, Just ignore that noise. In fact, you can just have that. Um, I've never seen you play this. What is it? I don't play it on stream, the boopy, because it's ridiculous. But it's called Cookie Clicker. You just click a cookie but it's more than that but I can't I'm not going into it I'm not going into it it's good though it costs like two quid on Steam or you can just play it in your browser if you want I got it on Steam because then I can see how long I've played it for which is which is good and I can show people off you used to play this on the computers at school really <laughs> nice I'd never played it until about two weeks ago. What a feral kitten outside today, very angry and hungry. Oh, is it all right now? Have you given it some? Sorry about the noise there, you gotta stop now because the thing's over. We'll give him, um, we'll get a ring for this one. Oh, unable. Unable? Oh, is it because I've got, I'm full up? Sorry, I didn't realize I'm full up on wrinklers. Fair enough. Take that. That's fine then. No problem. Um, give him a cookie. Yeah, give him a cookie. After I imported my save, all the Steam achievements synced. It went from 5% complete to 94. I didn't realise you could import the save. Otherwise, I would have done that. Because I, had, I was about at this point on the browser one. Fuck. It's one of the few sites not blocked. You go into it um, and everyone would have it on the background seeing who would get the most before the lesson ended. <laughs> nice. I like that. What are the little things eating the cookies? These are called uh, wrinklers. Cactus. And they look bad, but they're not. Because they take away 5% of your cookies per second. 
but they actually when you you can burst them and it gives you more than they eat if that makes sense so if you've actually got like loads of them it actually works out really well because you can just burst them all and you get a fucking ton of cookies from them i don't know how to explain it i was looking on the wikis a bit yesterday a little bit uh, I got a thing from Amazon here. Limited time deal. A deal you might like. A uh, dog clippers. Dog grooming kit. Professional heavy duty. We think you might like it. Sure. I have to look up this game. It's free online, Cactus. Take a look at it. You can just get it on. It's just on a browser. Might show my age now because that was nearly eight years ago. Time flies too fast. I wish I had this at school. Um, we never, we never had this one. Do you have a dog? No. <laughs> I don't have a dog. No, I don't have a pet at all. Weird. Been on this for a while. My legacy is currently at almost four and a half years. Fucking hell. There you go. There's the link for it. You can do Marley's nails. I'd rather not. I had a dream last night, everyone, that my mate found a cure for COVID. And all it was was a, a chocolate muffin with half a Ferrero Rocher on top. So if anyone's not tried that, you know. Oh, I need this because this one really gives you loads. I was given a ginger stray from dry treats from a massive bag the other day. I put the open bag on the worktop and it fell over and a full bag of dry cat food strewn all over the kitchen floor. I spent an age trying to clean it up. Oh, mate. Never tried to be nice. That's the, if yeah, that's the lesson that you've got from that. Good. It's good to learn a lesson. You got a bear, you can shave him. That is true. I had to cut a bit of the hair off him. Say hair, you know what I mean? Because some of it was a bit weird. It was like, oh, like, I don't know what it was. There was some bit up with it, and I just had to cut a bit off to fix it. It was weird. Um, I'm gonna get a chance maker. Three hundred and sixty-four billion cookies per second. That's given me. Imagine if that was the cure, and just no one's tried it. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Maybe I'm on something. I am. I bet I am. Moff out for now. See you all later. Take care, hoops. Have a good one, mate. Everyone except Mrs. Lights had negative LFTs today. Open it to recurring illness flag and it falls positive again. I hope she's all right, mate. I hope she's all right. Of course. Don't shave the bear. I won't be shaving the bear, trust me. I'll tell you what I love, by the way. I, I said I, I, I did say this a few days ago. I've not streamed a lot recently, so... For Christmas, my favourite present I got for Christmas was this. And I wasn't, I didn't even ask for it or anything like that. I was just giving it. Um, and I love it. It's a little wax melt thing. So you put your candle under there and it melts the wax. This has last me, lasted me in ages. By the way, that's that size. That's that size. I, I used the red one called Christmas Eve. I've used it every day for about eight hours every day and it is barely done anything to it it is amazing so you all you have to do is buy these shitty little tea lights and they're fine they're really cheap the wax won't run out but the scent will the, the scent is even like it is still going my christmas tangerine i didn't get one i didn't get a christmas tangerine Sadly. Gutted. Got an amazing candle right now where the wick crackles like a fire. I mean... I, I want to say something, Sloth, but I won't bother. Because it'll probably make me sound stupid. Only supposed to last eight hours in scent. Ah, oh, way longer than that. It's, it's weird. It's really weird. How the fuck are you meant to just... When when the scent's done then, how do you get it out? Do you just have to scoop it out? Well, 
What are you saving cookies for? Why not? Why not? Oh, I was going to say, I was just going to say, Sloth, it's just seen when where the wick crackles like a fire. And I, I just thought, well, a candle is a fire. Just a very small one. But... I think I, I've probably misunderstood what you said. At least I'm demanding Christmas stockings off my mum again. Me too. Me too. <laughs> He's a butter knife. Slide it in one side and it pops out. Oh, does it? Maybe I'll give that a go then. So I've got two more. I've got um, Candle Lit Cabin. And one called Christmas Cookie. Which sounds nice. Christmas Cookie. Cookie clicker? Full circle. Like a cookie. Just get loads of goodies in them. Tangerines, dates, chocolate coins. Yeah. Fact, we had some, we got some dates this year. They're nice. I never had them before. They're really good. I got a big box of biscuits the other day. Not even for Christmas, just afterwards. Do you know the McVitie's, the big box you get? Full of like a biscuit selection. Oh, I love them. Love them. I'm old, I'm old enough to appreciate them now. We used to get them every year from our uncle or whatever, and I never really appreciated them because I was more into, like, chocolate bars and stuff. But, nah. I'm into my biscuits now. I can appreciate Old lady biscuits, Jules. They're, they're proper biscuits. They're nice. Not old lady biscuits. When I think of old lady biscuits, I think of the old woman who lived two doors down. From or three doors down, sorry, from us when I was a kid. Um, just getting another set of cookies there, and we used to go around to her house. We were, we'd be playing out with my next door neighbour, my brother, and we'd go around to her house. I, I was about four or five at the time, and she'd invite us in, and she'd give us a rich tea, a rich tea biscuit. Rockies. See, I had them a lot in high school to the point where I'm off them now, massively. Sadly. But these have got like. I don't even know what they are. They're just different biscuits, aren't they? I think my nonna getting discounted broken biscuits from a pal who works in a biscuit factory. I'd love that. You can get boxes of broken biscuits now, can't you? You can buy big boxes of just broken biscuits. It's amazing. It's um, fantastic stuff. Rocky Robin. Love a Rocky. Pickups, yeah. I went I was in a big pickup phase a few years ago. Um very nice. That was very loud, by the way. Thank you very much for the follow. Shadow King 544. Appreciate that. Welcome in. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're having a good one. If you're here to see me build a chair, I've done it. I'm sorry. Um but there's always the VOD. Look about two. What was it about? It'd take away the first like 10 minutes because I was just having a chat. Probably about two hours. Probably about two hours to build that chair, which I suppose isn't too bad, I guess. Maybe. We have a biscuit factory in Edinburgh, all the broken biscuits your heart could dream of. That sounds lovely. One of my big childhood memories was going past the McVitie's factory once. That was it. As a child, I didn't understand the purpose of getting broken biscuits and asked my mum why people bought them. She said, so you don't have to break them on your own. <laughs> oh, so you don't have to break your own, sorry. <laughs> yeah. I have got a Terry's chocolate orange, everyone. I still need to chuck it somewhere. I don't know where. I was thinking of going outside and chucking it against the wall and seeing what happens. Um, I normally just chuck them on the floor. Or I should take a big bite out of it, like an apple. Would that really wind people up if I did that? Drop it from me. I've got a great height to drop it from, Manikai. Unless I actually go somewhere, which is not going to happen. Or against a wall. Chuck it down your neck. People hate everything. That is true. If I just took a, if I just open, if I just unwrapped it and just took a bite out of it, like an apple. It's not been in the fridge. It shouldn't be too hard. Be impressed with your teeth. You can take a big bite like an apple. Strenuous broke bacon biscuits. 
Right, everyone. I'm going to go take a bite out of a Terry chocolate orange. Like an apple. Um, I do need to... I, I need to sort this stuff out, though. And I'm So I'm going to take a break, and I'm going to be about five, maybe ten minutes while I just clear some of this stuff out. Um... Because it is just a mess, and I need to get rid of it all. Uh, mostly just foam and stuff like that. And I can, I'll can, i just put it in another room, and then I can just sort it out in another room tonight. All right? Does that sound good? My jaw be doing a lot of hard work. That's true. Banging it on a table works. Yeah, but there's no fun in that. <laughs> I used to just chuck them on the floor. Advertise a Terry chocolate orange is a free bonus if someone comes and takes a chair. I might do that. I might do that. I could do that. That's a good idea. Do it on stream. I will do it on stream. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna take a bite. I'll take a bite of it on stream, of course. When Jules took a bite of an onion. Yeah, it's gonna be like that. Gonna go to work. Bye bye. Enjoy chair. Thank you very much, Sophie, for being here. Thank you. I appreciate it. Have a good time at work if you can. Um. Yeah, I'll, I'll take a bite of it on stream. Sure. I've just got to take a break first for you know. I don't know how long. Sorry, I'm 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 on a clicking frenzy and cookie clicker here. So I'm just making the most of it. Was that 2020, Robbie, or was that this year? That was this year. That's what I thought. Did I get your cookie clicker pro tip? I did. I did. I I, I did. Thank you very much. I, I did I, I was doing that anyway. I'm I'm a pro, you know. I'm a pro like that. But thank you very much. Right. I need to stop playing that because it's going to drive me mad. Um, right. I'll be back in about five minutes then, everyone. Maybe a little bit longer. Um, ow. 2002 memory. Yeah. Exactly. Right. I'm going to run some ads. If you're not subbed, don't worry about it. Just mute them. It's just for the pre-roll crap that people have to live with, so they don't have to live with it. I'll be about five, ten minutes. Um, I get a cup of tea as well, actually. All right. I'll see you soon. 